Hello, Constantin here. So today we're gonna do a quick unboxing of a new EK water block for the Intel Alder Lake series. For those who are looking into this, um, they've just uh, started to be delivered. Um, so I've ordered mine at the end of October on the 29th and it was delivered today, which is the 16th of December. So there is a bit of a, there was a bit of a waiting line on them, but um, I think they're just coming to, to the market and they're going to become available. So the reason why I bought one is I like to water cool my PCs and from what I've heard and what I've read, um, the new Alder Lake series is quite a bit of, um, you know, it gets likes to block hot, just like the whole Intel series. Um, excuse my dog in the back, he's just overexcited. So, um, yeah, I still didn't get the parts for the new Alder Lake build that I'm going to do because literally they're not available. So the motherboard that I've ordered hasn't arrived yet. I've got the RAM, the new DDR5 from Kingston Fury. Um, I've just got the water block, but I'm still waiting on some bits and bobs for uh, the final build. So let's get on with it. As you can see it here, I've ordered the EK Quantum Velocity 2 1700, the copper acetal version, because it just looks really nice. I'll, I'll show it to you in a minute. Uh, straight when I got the package, I knew that it was the water block because it's very heavy. So I weighed it, it's 600 grams, so it's massive, well built, the kind of quality you'd expect for something like EK. So let's get on with that. Yes. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, let's open this bad boy. What do we have here? So in the box, you have another box, of course. And in the other box, you have a, if I need to open this bad boy here, somehow, right. Small leaflet, which says EK is caring about the environment, although they sent me a ton of paper, but no, it's got some help in them in a QR code. And inside the box, there is a Huge, massive water block. Velocity 2 for the 1700. Now, it's really thick. I'll open it in a minute. And I quite like the new LED line, which is like this. No. Right, second bit and bobs, you got Allen keys. And on this series, they're actually putting thermal grizzly conductive paste, which is always welcome. I have a ton of this, but I always welcome some more. Right, let's have a look at the bad boy. So you wouldn't expect too much to be in a water block. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Let me open this bad boy here. Okay. Oof. So, from the start, let me rotate it backwards. It has a nice peel, which I'm not going to unpeel right now. Uh, ooh, let's do it a little bit. Yes. Ooh. I love the acetal color because the motherboard is going to be Asus Black. So, this black guy with the Asus Black motherboard is going to be great. I love the new LED line. You got your EK sign here. You got massive, massive, massive chunk of copper. And you've got a little support bracket for the back. Well, this you need this. So you you can attach it to the motherboard. And you've got like um a cable for the RGB, and it does look like it's one of those uh RGB that EK uses. Is it the RGB or something like that? Yeah. It's not very long. Well, actually, it is long. It is quite long. So I'm sure this will fit. The support pins here, they don't look really, really beefy, but I'm pretty sure they'll do the job. They have to be quite small to fit through the motherboard, uh, you know, little holes. But yeah, it is it is quite heavy. So this is like 580, 550 grams of 
material here. I'm expecting it to be nickel and copper. And it's well built. As you'd expect from EK. And when ordering these things, always check if you have fittings, adequate fittings for it. I always keep spares, loads of spares, and I always order the fittings. So yeah, I'm not gonna, well, this is just an unboxing. I can't do the final build yet, but I will be doing it, and hopefully I'll do another YouTube video with it. Just going through the website, just to show you how it is when it actually works. I'll, I'll do a quick um, browser snapshot here. So this is how it looks like when it's all lit. It, it's just beautiful, isn't it? And this is how much it costs in Europe right now, 105 euros. I've paid about uh, the same from overclockers. Um, that's another version with the clear persplex or whatever it's called. Um, that's the mount. That's an example of how to mount it on the back of the motherboard. Just be careful when doing that. And this is what it, it says it contains inside, which it does. So thermal grease. Um, you got a socket LGA. 1700 which is the new socket allen keys and back blade mounting mechanism the instructions on how to mount them if you want to read the instructions will be online and they're over here i'll put this link below my video as well just so you guys can see it yeah so that's it um hopefully i'll do a video when the CP my cpu arrives and my motherboard and um, yeah we'll get to see this beast in action but from what i can tell you i've been using ek water block products for quite a while now and they're good they do their job properly and yeah they don't break down so um i don't know thank you for watching this i hope you find it useful i'll put this on your youtube give me a like uh, or subscribe if you want to but you know I i'll do these videos when whenever i got time and stuff thank you very much guys see you later bye